one of the top eight out of more than 600 people who submitted. I was ecstatic. It surprised me, so I didn't really know it was coming. Congratulations. Thank you. <laughs> when I found out, my initial reactions were shocked, relieved, ecstatic. Very cool. <laughs> well, it's definitely a big confidence booster. <laughs> Congratulations. I'm, gonna you. I'm so happy for you. Oh my god. Whoa, this is so good. All right. Congratulations. You are one of the top eight. Oh, wow, that's awesome. Oh my gosh, really? Are you serious though? No, I'm joking. <laughs> You're going! Yes! Yeah. So I have always loved the fashion industry, specifically like cosmetics and skincare. My case study was my collaboration between Vitamin Water Zero and ELF. So I feel like these products would be super helpful for people on the go, they're busy during their day trying to squeeze in a workout. But ever since then I've been like obsessed with the industry and following the latest trends and what we could do to like fill some of the white space and create new opportunities. Over the summer, I was an uh, intern at Old Navy, and I had the opportunity to pitch this kind of sustainability idea to the SVP of design and the COO. So the most interesting thing I learned during the case study was just the extent that the ocean plastic pollution problem is and the effect it's having on the world. I grew up with the family background that both my parents are artists. I started drawing since I was four, and my dad wanted me to be a painter, but I think I want my art and my ideas to be more accessible, so that's why I choose to work in fashion. Growing up, I was always surrounded by a household of really strong, amazing women, and so I saw those similarities within the women in the fashion industry, and I was really inspired by them. Winning this was just the confirmation that my hard work and dedication will pay off. I've always kind of understood visual things really well, and so when I'm looking at clothes, something just like clicks sometimes when something looks right to me. And I just really like looking at the visual parts of fashion and fashion merchandising. Hey everyone, my name is Sarah Crossan. I am a fashion blogger and the executive online editor for our university magazine. My professors really exposed me to the fashion industry sustainability problems. The future of fashion is hopefully in a more sustainable direction. That's both social sustainability and environmental sustainability. With the way that fashion's going, it's definitely moving towards technology, also bearing in mind sustainability. So I wanted to take a different angle with that and pursue the idea of changing the way in which people shop so it can benefit both the buyer and the environment at the same time. I was inspired to go into the fashion industry because actually when I was younger, I was um, homeless in California. But one thing I do remember about that experience and having nothing is that my mom always made sure that I had a nice clean pair of vans because that's something that really um, I really enjoyed and made me happy. In retrospect, I realized that clothes and apparel have the opportunity to make people feel really good about any situation they may be in. When I was doing my case study, I learned that if I take my passions for advocacy and the fashion slash retail industry, I could really make a change. Fashion does have the ability to change the world. Winning this scholarship really gave me a level of reassurance and confidence in my dreams and my goals and just made them like that much more achievable. It just felt really good to, you know, get that validation for work that I worked really hard on. It was really exciting to me to be in the top eight this year because they give me just a pretty big confidence boost. I'm super excited for FSF to guide me to mentors who can help propel my career. And I see the scholarship as a pivotal chance for me to get my foot in the big apple. I think it's really important to have these opportunities for me to do something really powerful and really legitimate. Being able to meet actual industry professionals and be part of this wider network is also so important. I think it's going to be really great for my career. I think it's just so exciting and I'm really grateful for this opportunity. I want to thank the Fashion Scholarship Fund for completely changing the trajectory of my life. I can just not thank you all enough for this opportunity. <laughs>